Brookside drama takes place in the close, but this morning the crew and two members of the cast, Peter Christian and Diane Burke, playing Frank Rogers and his daughter Katie, have travelled to West Derby Cemetery for a touching graveyard scene. The actors will have several rehearsals before this three and a half minute scene is finally recorded. Today they're going through their scripts with AJ, the director responsible for this week's episodes. Like I did on the first shot, just, just look at it for a while. Yes, just for a couple of beats, but less yes, time yeah, than on yeah. that shot. And then, so I'm going to want to get in for you to, to grab that. And when Peter leans into frame, Jeff, yeah. that's when I'm going to want you to start to track back. Okay? And Di, if you take a beat after Peter's lent in and clean some of the grass, then you can um, start your dialogue. Okay. The cemetery was selected months ago, and the only prop needed today is this portable gravestone with Frank Rogers' father's name on. As the rehearsals continue, the director carefully monitors close-up shots on his own special screen. The Rogers family arrived three years ago. They're headed by Peter Christian as Frank and his wife Chrissy, played by Ethna Brown. They have two daughters, Sammy and Katie, and a son, Jeff. Like all households, they have their problems. Do you get parental feelings towards the children? Um, I shout at them if they haven't got coats on. Yeah, you do, actually. Try it until, you, yeah. you do. It's, 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 uh, it's funny. I mean, we were at uh, one particular charity thing when Rachel was some chap was, young chap was shouting, you know, whatever, you know. Mm -hmm. And the dad was coming out me, you know. That's my daughter, you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, um, and especially young uh, Diane, you know, I mean, she's just lovely. Yeah, she's you just great. And she lets you play with her hair and things like that. I mean, she's just <laughs> so nice. She is sort of, yeah. she, you know, she'll just sit next to you and you sort of play. And you, you do feel yeah. like motherly with them, you know, because but that, that, that's really nice when that comes over on the screen because there'll just be something like you talk to them and you straighten their hair automatically, you know, as a mum anyway. Like most characters on The Close, the Rogers don't have an easy time. Daughter Sammy, played by Rachel Lindsay, is recovering from alcoholism, brought on after seeing her boyfriend Owen, played by Danny McCall, horrifically injured in a car crash. You're a family here and you, you can, you're in something like you know what you're doing. If you're chopping about and doing different things, you could get really like, you know, mixed up. But here you know, you come in and you know what your character is, you know what part you're playing, you know the way, um, the way he says things. So it's great, it's hard work and it is tiring. A lot of people think, oh, you go in and say lines, but that's just, you know, their ignorance really. It is a hard work, but it's great. It's like a family and we have a laugh, don't we? I think it's very rewarding too. And also, Rachel and I do a lot of charity work. Mm -hmm. And I think it's great that because, you know, the programme's popular, we're able to raise money for charities. Yeah. One of the youngest members of the Brookside cast is 13-year-old Diane Burke, who manages to juggle her schoolwork around her part as Katie Rogers. I didn't really want to be an actress. It wasn't one of me. I just like drama generally, and so that's how it all started. So how did you end up at Brookside? Well, because I started in a play at school, and then what happened was there was an audition going for Brookside, and so... ART rang up and said, could you get a few girls down for this audition? And so we went into Liverpool for, this, for the audition and um, I read through quite a lot. And then I just didn't think nothing of it. I didn't think I was going to get it. I just thought it was an experience for me. And then I got chosen for the second audition. But both my friends were in an audition as well and they didn't get it. So I felt a bit bad and you're guilty. And then... I came to actual Brookside for the second audition and there was three of us and we just went into an office and it was, it was just like a personality test really. When the cameras stop rolling, the Rogers family is still together. Esther Brown treats the children like her own and the parental concern spills over. Indeed, many of the cast see Brookside as an extension of their own families. It's a small set up here and it's, you know, it's, it's a close and... Um, we all work together like five days a week and there's the long hours and that. You do, I mean, you socialise with the people from work. Um, so, like the likes of Sparks and, and the crew and that, they become your friends as well. Not just colleagues, but a lot of them become your friends. The family feeling on Brookside goes very deep. And it's one of the vital ingredients that makes this series so popular.